Neil here at Toolstop TV. I'm here with Mike from Rigid Tools. Now in your hand, Mike, this is something that you would have seen in a Flash Gordon movie. A phaser gun. But we don't think it isn't that really. What is it? It's not a phaser gun, no, Neil. Um, this is one of the uh, the range of locators that, that we do here at Ridge Tool. This one is the Navitrack Scout. Now this is a tool that we would sell primarily to the drainage industry. This is what we would use for locating a drain sonde or a transmitter, which is a small device that a drainage engineer would rod down a, a drain right. and enable him to actually trace uh, perhaps a collapse or something like that. So pinpointing a drain sonde, and this is a scout, and this is what we'd uh, use to do that job. Okay, so we've got this scout, which is going to do that then. We now move on to this yellow device here. <laughs> Yep, we change colour, so we go yeah. from the uh, the Scout, the red one. Um, staying with the same kind of technology that went into the Scout, we have this thing, the SR20 from Rigid. Now, um, very similar to the Scout in that we've got these globes going on here. Mm -hmm. uh, and this is what's really different about our range of locators. They have 360 degrees of vision. So mm -hmm. most kind of locating tools simply work in one plane and you have to sort of sweep them back and forth. What this does, it has vision all the way around itself. And uh, th these are just aerials at the end of the day. They're, they're no difference between this and what you'd listen to Terry Wogan on the radio with. <laughs> these aerials are picking up radio signals that, that, that are either down in the ground that you've uh, introduced right. or occur naturally. And, and that's what's going on here. But this is the kind of thing, instead of going to the drainage industry, mm. SR20 is very much aimed at the utility locating industry. Those yeah. people want to find buried cables, buried pipes, uh, buried telecoms, those kind of things things okay and to complement the SR20 we, we have a range of add-on bits and pieces so uh, we talked about drain sons earlier so these things here these are little mini transmitters that are battery powered that you can either float or you can rod mm -hmm. down a drain and you can actually locate these using Scout or SR20 so does this thing rely on these transmitters or can it pick up uh, drains and cables without these transmitters being in the system? It, it, can, it can do both. Um, right. You can use your own signals, um, either be by sonde or the, this, these things are a range of transmitters that mm. put out a signal. But also buried cables and buried pipes uh, carry naturally occurring signals and, right. and SR20 can, can locate, locate those. But okay. th these things here, transmitters, as I said earlier, um, we've got three, we've got various power outputs starting here at sort of 5 watt up to 10 watt and then up to the big Q-ring. And these whack out power that then can be actually traced on the buried cables and pipes. And we also have a, a, this, which is a, um, a clamp device. You can actually clamp that around a cable or a mm -hmm. pipe. You connect it to a generator, and then you squirt your own signal down, down the, the right. cable. Okay. And what sort of depths can you go here? Is there particular capacities on these? Depths vary um, depending on, on the kind of transmitter that you're using. Obviously, if you're putting more power on the line, you're going to get to a, deep, a deeper depth. But you can quite easily get five meters and, and much further than that. So that's the SeekTech range from Rigid, explained beautifully there by Mike. Thanks very much. It's all available at toolstop.co.uk.